Hi everyone and welcome back. Really pleased you could join us today. Today is going to be our last video here in London for the foreseeable future. We're going up to York, we're going up to Leeds and we're going up to another place as well but you'll see that coming up very soon. Where are we today? We're just off American, America Square, not far from Fenchurch um, Station and literally a stone's throw from the Tower of London. We're under the railway arches and we're going to Divine. Now Divine is rated the number one caf in the whole of London and on TripAdvisor it's up there as number one, number two restaurant in the whole of London, which is quite amazing. I'm really looking forward to this. I'm absolutely starving. As always, let's give it a go. Okay, I've got the menu in front of me. Before I start, what pleasant people they are here. It's family owned, it's a husband and wife team and uh, the sons come in when they're not working. Really, really, really excellent service. The restaurant itself or the cafe itself, nice open and really, really spacious, really clean as well. Uh, I like the fact it's open plan so you can actually see exactly what they're cooking. Anyway, on to the breakfast. Lots of breakfast items here. You guys take a, a quick look at it, see what you think. Me, I'm going to go for their full English, which is fried egg, bacon, sausage, mushrooms, tomato, baked beans and toast. He's kindly replaced the mushrooms with some black pudding. That's £9. And I've also ordered that because he's recommended it. With a, instead of a cup of Rosie Lee, he reckons he's cappuccino. It's absolutely fantastic. So I'm going to have a cappuccino as well. I'll see you when the breakfast arrives. Looking forward to this. Okay, so I've got my cappuccino here. I didn't say how much that was. Cappuccino is £2.50. Oh, looks nice and frothy. Look at that. That looks lovely and frothy. Lovely and frothy. That is really good, actually. Really, really good. If the breakfast is half as good as the cappuccino, I'm laughing here. If you eat with your eyes, this does look amazing. Take a look at that. Presentation wise, that does look very, very, very good. I'm gonna start with the sausage. Nice skin on the sausage. Take a close up on that. That is one really good sausage. Really, really tasty. You taste the pork in there. That is a quality, quality sausage. Now, for the egg. How's the egg cooked? Oh. Eggs cooked perfectly. Beautiful colour to the yolk there. That's very, very tasty. 
Now the black pudding. That's a quality black pudding as well. Nice marbling of fat there. We'll just take a closer look at that, just so you can see the marbling of the fat. Nice and creamy inside as well. Now onto the bacon. Again, the bacon's cooked perfectly. Nice and smoky. Lovely flavour to it. Let's try the beans. Mm. Beans are beans, but they're good beans. Tomato. Nice and soft, the tomato. Nice griddling on top there. And they're very fresh. The toast it comes already buttered. And try that with a few beans. Mm. That's fresh bread, which has obviously been sliced as well. That's really, really good. I have a little combo. A bit of sausage. A bit of bacon. Black pudding and egg. The whole works. Mm. That's really good. All the ingredients on there are top quality. Every single item there is very, very, very tasty and it's really good. I'm really enjoying this. I understand now why this is the number one rated cafe in the whole of London. That is really good. I'm going to tuck in and I'll see you guys shortly. Try my cappuccino again as well. Very nice. You hear the trains going on top as well. If you hear some rumbling in the background, don't worry. It hasn't started raining again here in London. It's just the trains. See you shortly. Divine by name, divine by nature. That was a very, very enjoyable breakfast. Really enjoyable. Before I go through the breakfast, one of the interesting things that I've noticed is some of the uh, cafes that we've done, uh, as in Palo's Caf, Terry's Caf, and this one here, Divine's, are all privately owned and family businesses. And what they create is a fantastic atmosphere quality food on a plate and fantastic standards as well. There's a real common theme there and a common thread. On to the breakfast. Sausage was cooked delightfully. It, it, it was perfectly griddled, had a real, real tight uh, skin on it, cut into it, beautiful fat content in there. That was a quality sausage. The egg, free range, cut into that. You saw the color of the yolk. That was really, really good as well. The bacon, nice and smoky, cooked again to perfection. Love the black pudding. You can see the marbling in the black pudding. The tomato was very nice and soft. The beans were real, real good beans. And the, uh, the toast, that was quality bread as well. All together, that was one fantastic, fantastic breakfast. 
there's a reason why they're number one on TripAdvisor, and that is because they're so confident in what they actually deliver. Service, outrageously good, really friendly in here, really nice people. Now I've come at a, a lucky time because I've got in just after the breakfast rush and just before their lunchtime rush. So I'm, I'm kind of lucky there. The location as well, it's brilliant hearing the trains going over the top, the, the little rumble of thunder or the rumble of the trains going on top, that's great. Marks out of 10. Come on, it's simple, isn't it? They're number one for a reason. It is a 10 out of 10 and a beyond deserved 10 out of 10. The whole package here is truly amazing. You've got to remember we are located here in central London. Only a couple of minutes, as I said earlier, earlier on, from the Tower of London. Nine pounds for the breakfast, two pound fifty for the cappuccino. No service charge, but I am going to leave a tip here because the service is that good. If you could like and subscribe to the channel, you know I really, really appreciate that. And until next time, cheers. I really enjoyed myself today. That was really good. Bye.